connectedness. We're all connected, whether it be on a subtle or intricate level. We're all elements of consciousness at the end of the day, just conduits or expressions of God. God is in us, and we are in God. Everything is everything. So if we continue to identify with these pseudonyms or misnomers, such as being black, white, um, Dominican, Puerto Rican, um, Sudanese, Nigerian, Ethiopian, uh, Scottish, Irish, uh, British, Chinese, Japanese, all these these misinterpreted words and these these labels that we give ourselves will is very divisive we divide ourselves on so many levels and most importantly we have that division within self within our inner beingness and that's what's causing these these problematic situations now and if we don't become aware of this then we will never get out of that problematic cycles of life we are you are me and I am you starts you know revering or revering the inner beingness, that that interior of that shell that we see on a physical form. You know, our actions affect us on so many levels, whether it be a direct or indirect deposit. We affect everything. When our actions create dissonance within the individual, we feel that dissonance or discordance we create it. When our actions create harmony and empowerment within the individual, we feel that that harmony and empowerment, empowerment in which we create it. So, start seeing yourself as, you know, that element of consciousness, the expression of God itself. And once you start seeing yourself as that, then, I mean, you inevitably see other people as that. You don't see them as persons. You see them as just consciousness. You know, labeling yourself as being conservative or libertarian. My house is bigger than yours. Your house is smaller than mine. My car is more luxurious. Your car is more mundane. My car is faster. Your car is slower. I have better shoes. My shoes are Nike. Yours is Adidas. These are all illusions in which we deal with this matrix. This world we call matrix. Well, this matrix we call life. This is all a, it's a test, an examination to see if we can really come out of this despondent and decadent way of thinking so in essence see yourself as essence the essence of consciousness and start seeing everything else as that because that's all we are we are everything and everything is us as above so below as within so without the universe is us we are the universe start seeing yourself that way then we'll be able to get out these these problematic cycles of life as i stated before all right peace